Do you want to increase your brand awareness? Then video marketing helps you grow. The best tool to work on video production is Ofio. Hello guys, I'm Yu Kumar from Upgrid. Today I'm talking about Ofio, a perfect video making SaaS. Ofio is an online video maker that enables you to create short videos which grabs the attention of the users. Ofio offers pre-designed video templates with one-click integration of your brand logo and style. Ofio feature includes extensive designer templates for your video, wonderful user interface and 500 plus soundtracks in various modes for your video to act. Before we go into the details of this tool, make sure to subscribe us on YouTube channel and follow us on the Facebook group. Guys, there is a special announcement. So currently we are offering a hundred dollars worth freebie for the exclusively video watches. Get it from the link on the video description. This is also available on video presentation. My colleague will give you a walkthrough on Ofio. Give a glance on it. Hello everyone. So welcome to the Upgrade channel. So this is the Ofio platform as you can see. Click here to log in into your account. If you don't have an account, just quickly sign up by using this sign up button. Let me just quickly log in for you. So once you logged in, this is how it looks like the Ofio platform. So if you want to create your own custom theme for your uh, videos, you can create by simply using this my brand button. So once you clicked it, it asks you to upload a brand logo if you have any or you can just replace the theme by simply clicking the replace theme. I've already created a theme. If you want me to show how to replace a theme, I'll just show you. Simply click here, uh, replace theme. So once you clicked it, it asks you to choose a uh, pick a color. I choose the red and white. If you want to change a color, you can simply change by simply using these color buttons. And you have various um, styles, modern, abstract, variant, vibrant. So you can choose according to your requirements. So as you can see, this is how it looks like. This shows the draft of your end product theme. So once you've done this, just simply click next then you have to pick the font so it has modern it has 22 fonts and there is one again striking it has 19 fonts you can select or you can also apply your own logo if you have any so just select one font and simply click next so it asks you to it asks it is it asks you to confirmation just simply click confirm once you set up once you finish setting up the brand you can create a project by simply using these stories as you can see there are various uh, formats social media post and story and full hd and facebook cover and there are more formats that are coming soon so you can also pick your own custom size i'll simply go with full hd for now so once you click it it asks you to choose templates or if you want to use a blank canvas so i'll pick one template this this is the template which I have created before as you can see which I have created the theme in my brand section and these are the pre-built templates I'll choose with pre-built templates so there are couple of templates in it just pick one according to your requirements I'll just pick one template uh, I'll just pick this so once you picked it it asks you to pick couple of style uh, it asks you to pick a style there are a couple of styles over here as you can see just pick one according to your requirements so I'm just going to with this and add selected scenes just wait for it so once you finished it you can actually increase the a time uh, the duration of the video like if you want to three seconds you just simply use this plus and minus button and this button is used to duplicate the project and this is used to change the 
this template if you want to change the templates once you created it just simply click it to edit on it so as you can see there are a bunch of options to edit the template i'll explain each and everything for now so design option is used to choose the template i've already chosen the template so i'll just go with style for now so style is to it it is uh, it asks you to if you want to change the uh, font style or anything just simply click using a uh, style button and choose one style according to your requirements so i'll just play you for now look at it how it plays so if you look closely over here see the video which is only playing about 2 seconds but we have chosen the time duration 4 seconds so this is nothing but <clears throat> the whole video we have uh, the time duration of the whole video is 4 seconds but the actual video is only let me show you the timeline you will just understand how what it is so so this is the timeline this is the 4 seconds timeline and this is the only 2 seconds video so if you want to put any other video in this timeline you can just put it or if you want to play this only video so you just copy it and paste it there or you can also slow it down to 4 seconds so this is how it works so so this is how you can change the uh, font style and you can also add your own custom uh, font by simply clicking on it and typing i'll just type something great so if you want to decrease the size of the font you can you can simply do it by simply clicking this button you can also do it by here so you can also reposition by simply doing this you can also do it by here alignments if you want to change the upper case the letters you can change it by simply clicking this button and there are a bunch of options if you want to change the font style you can do it by simply clicking that font button and you can also change the color of it by simply clicking this text color so i'll go with the default color so there are effects that you can apply uh, that you can animate your text simply click the effects button as you can see there are bunch of effects there is a text background if you click if you turn it on there is a background to the text i don't and you can also change the height and the transparency like uh, the shape and everything you can also change the color of the background i don't want it you can also make it shadow to that font and that is a beta program you, you got to pay some money for that and there is a blur option reflex option ground shadow so i'll just leave it to you i leave it to you guys to check this all out and there is an animate uh, section which i have already told and position is nothing but to change the font i mean the font i mean the text position and transparency as i have said you to change how much opacity do you want the text text to be appear like this so and this is the option to duplicate it and this is the option to delete it so once you fix with the font i mean text we can go with the graphic section where you can add the graphics to your video see if you want to add this type of shapes there are bunch of shapes and videos that you can add graphics and you can add to that video so there are overlay sections and there is a effect sections where you can add everything motion graphics to your video i have to pick some different color so let me just pick one graphics to it yeah this one so it ask it, it shows the suggestions once you click the paint and nick it will show the bunch of suggestions for you you can pick one so once you clicked it it automatically add it to the video you can change the color of it and add text to it as you can see this is appearing on the text if you want it to be appear on the behind of the text you have to just uh, simply drag the layer of that motion graphics to the below the layer of the text just simply like that then it is done so once you finish it up setting graphics there is a stocks uh, app stocks uh, button in which there are uh, unlimited photos and videos everything are there stock photos you can simply pick one and add to the background of that video and there is a background section separate background section where you can add the background to the video 
there are images patterns videos you can choose according to your requirements and there are pre built music this is the most uh, useful thing once you click the music button there is a bunch of music options where you can add music to your video and there is a file section where you got where if you have any pre built uh, file that you wanted to upload to the upload to the ofi on you wanted to edit it you can simply click the file section and upload it with it and you can add to it and you can edit it and save is the button that you can if you want to save that uh, edited project you can save it by simply clicking this and animate is the thing which if, if you want to add any effects to the video you can do it by simply clicking that animate button if you click the fade in button it simply fade ins if you click the wipe in it starts with wiping the text so this is how you got to do so once you finish it setting this all as you can see these are the layers of that uh, video so we can individually select that particular layer and you can edit that particular layer so if you want to edit that particular layer just simply turn off these uh, videos i mean layers then you just pick that layer and just edit it according to your you know choice so click on it and you can edit see if you want to drag or if you want to change the any background to it you can simply do it so this is how it all works this is the timeline if you want to edit the individual layer you can also do it on timeline so by simply dragging this individual layer to the next uh, time you can do that also you can also animate a layer in this timeline by simply clicking this individual button this is all your works how it works and you can individually edit it by simply clicking the plus button you can uh, animate the text if and that layer particular layer if you want to edit this graphics simply click on it and it shows how much animation do you want the speed and what animation do you need so everything is there individually so this is how it works once you finish it all setting up you can simply click the download button to download the video see if you are creating a video it will click the video button if you want creating the image if you want the image or simply video just choose one according to your requirements and the storyboard button is so this is the storyboard so how it looks like the videos which you've created are appear on here so if you want the videos uh, to be more duration you can just simply uh, add scene in it and you know you can choose a different template and make it as a uh, full video like 10 seconds 20 seconds as usual it's like complete uh, storyboard so once you've done this just uh, click download button to download the video and you can use it so that's it basically of your platform hope you all got everything and thanks for watching thank you guys hope you enjoyed our session on offio so do not forget to subscribe us on youtube and follow us on facebook group thank you